is Dr. Lynn from Therapy Resources. We're gonna do ultrasound on the lumbosacral area. Um, this patient have a slight increase on um, uh, lumbar curvature due to some degeneration more on the lower section of the lumbar area. So we're gonna use ultrasound to let the heat penetrate on those joints so we can increase the circulation that will help decrease the pain on the area. So Mark behind the camera, our PT assistant, is gonna set the ultrasound for me and we'll um, get back on you guys. Okay, so we're back. Right now, we're, we're gonna be doing ultrasound on the paraspinal area, yeah, focusing on the lower lumbar area, which I would say L3 to L4, L5 to S1, okay? Our weight do fall um, at between L5 and S1, and that is where she do have most of the um, the generation I would say in that area so the exercises that she um, is um, doing as part of her home exercises would be um, the William flexion exercises which is the pelvic tilt uh, the single knee to chest so anything that would increase the movement of the pelvis um, posteriorly and upward in order to um, decrease the, the lumbar cur curvature on the area or the excessive lumbar curvature is going to help. And of course, um, we did advise her to um, try to lose weight as well and strengthen the abdominals because a strong abdominal area is gonna help support the back when you are doing um, any of your functional activities such as uh, bending, lifting, uh, or twisting. So that's it for today. See you.